girl guys like why is god so funny why is the holy spirit so funny okay so i just posted a video you make them better right like i know the song i don't know the lyrics the full lyrics but i remember that part of the song but this is why when god gives you songs you gotta look up the lyrics okay god is so funny so when i got this message you know i put it out for you guys just now and i had to scream just now when i read the lyrics Especially at this part, because on the side of every great man, you can find a woman like a soldier holding him down. And I just scream because why has God been giving me this soldier analogy for the last four or five videos? Haven't you guys been hearing me talk about this soldier analogy in the warfare, how there's warfare and we're like God's soldiers? I even gave you guys a scripture just now about Paul talking to Timothy and saying how we are God's soldiers. <laughs> I just had to scream. I just had to scream when I saw... God is so funny. He is so strategic. I'm telling you guys, he is so strategic. And the way how God does things, it's like everything he gives me, like all the messages he gives me, they all connect together. And then he gave me a song that I have not... I don't even know the full lyrics to the song. I just remember that course. And I decided to look it up and I'm seeing the part about the soldier and how we are like... Kingdom wives are, are like... And kingdom husbands are like soldiers holding each other down. Like... And I remember how I was saying how the Holy Spirit is the center of it all. This is deep. Oh, on the other note, God is serious about what I said in the last video about um, you make them better. He is serious. Like, literally, like, ladies, even gents, like, get on your A-game. Like, I understand the warfare is tough. I understand sometimes you want to give up. But God, God said out of his mouth, out of the mouth of the Holy Spirit, he said, okay, Someone can love you for who you are and they can accept every flaw about you. But if you're not comfortable with yourself, if you're not confident in yourself, you're gonna you're not gonna see you're not gonna believe the love they have for you. You get what I'm saying? You're not gonna see how much they love you because you don't even see it in yourself. Do you get what I mean? And it's like the other spouse video I put out there where I said if the person doesn't have confidence in themselves, how do you expect them to believe? that you have confidence in them how do you expect them to even feel worthy if they don't have confidence in themselves and the reason why i'm saying this is because he he actually gave me a message to put out later on for you guys not i don't know if it's today or if i have to do, if i'm supposed to do it in another video but um he'll give me the directions on that but um he's really serious where he's saying y'all you got to take care of yourself like take care of yourself your your physical your spiritual everything like Take care of what you're watching, what you're listening to, like pay attention to what you're putting your energy into. And if you feel like, you know what, I got to start going to the gym, go to the gym. I got to start eating healthy, eat healthy, like take care of yourself. You know, if you are going to be standing beside your partner, right, and your partner loves you for you, but you don't feel confident, that can reflect. You get what I'm saying? You can end up projecting that onto your partner, right? So take care of yourself, ladies and gents. Okay, love you guys. Bye.